Force is a push or pull upon an object that causes it to move. Force is measured in newtons. A newton is the amount of force required to give a mass of 1 kilogram an acceleration of 1 meter per second squared. In this example, we see force being placed upon a spring. Energy is the ability to perform work. There are two categories of energy, potential and kinetic. Potential energy is energy which results from an object's configuration or position. Kinetic energy is energy which an object has by reason of its motion. When a force has been applied to a spring, for example, the spring gains potential energy. When the applied force is removed, the spring returns to its original state, thus releasing kinetic energy. Work is the amount of energy transmitted by a force. In this example, the work being done is the amount of energy it takes to compress the spring. Work is measured in joules. A single joule is the energy expended by a force of one newton moving one meter along the direction of the force. Knowing the amount of energy required to compress the spring tells us how much work is involved. But that is not the whole story. If we can also factor in the amount of time it takes, we can calculate a quantity known as power. Power, then, is the rate at which work is done. This, in turn, means that power is the rate at which energy is transmitted. Power is measured in watts. A single watt is the rate at which work is done when an object is moving at one meter per second against a force of one newton. The formula for calculating power is P equals E over T, where P is power, E is energy, and T is time.